Getting married? Here are some tips from Money Sense. Tip number one: Communicate your expectations, but learn to give and take. Spend within your means and decide as a couple how much money to set aside for wedding expenses. Tip number two: Your dream wedding need not be costly. Consider a cheaper venue and enlist the help of your family and friends to help with photography or help decorate and make the place special. Celebrating with your loved ones is what matters most. Tip number three: Set a budget and stick to it. Which are the items you need, and which are the ones you want on your wedding list? Set a budget and prioritize to make sure you don't overspend and wipe out your savings. Tip number four: Avoid borrowing for your wedding. Your wedding should be a happy affair. Do not borrow to pay for a wedding. Take time to save up to cover your wedding expenses. Don't start the marriage in debt. Tip number five: Shop around for the best deal. Shop around and compare the different bridal packages available. You can visit exhibitions and attend promotional events to find out what is available. Don't forget to take a chance at negotiating with suppliers for extras or freebies. Tip number six: Keep your guest list manageable. Do not expect all guests to provide monetary gifts that can cover the cost of your wedding banquet. Remember, you are inviting them because you want them to be there. So keep your guest list to your comfort level. Tip number seven: Plan ahead for your wedding. You may be able to get early bird promotions if you purchase your wedding items early. For popular venues, they may be booked six months to a year in advance. So book your desired venue as soon as you set the date. Tip number eight: Planning your finances. An important aspect of living together is to be able to manage your finances as a family. Start by drawing up budgets jointly. Set common goals like building emergency funds or saving up for your children's education. Tip number nine: Making joint decisions. Avoid impulsive spending or borrowing. Where possible, do not make large financial decisions on your own without checking with your partner. Don't let money issues cause a strain in your relationship. Tip number ten: Happily ever after. Getting married is just the first step to your life together. Make plans for the future you want to share, and even during retirement. The earlier you start planning, the easier it will be to reach your goals.